hello and welcome back to my channel welcome if you're new we're back at home goods it's time to find out what was in the boxes are you ready let's shop how cute is that poof love it two hundred dollars for this piece right here it's all the Moroccan vibes, of course, $80 for this lantern. But if you were here last week, you know that they were putting out lots of items. There was a lot of things in boxes at my local home goods. And we talked about me coming back to find out what was in the boxes. Well, we're gonna find out, but guess what? Spoiler alert, there's still boxes. So, you know, we're gonna have to come back yet again which who's complaining who's complaining i'm not i'm ready to come back already 500 dollars for this piece right here did you see that did you see the detail i mean i am sure that is handcrafted all the things very nice very eclectic love it 60 dollars for this table super cute i love how they like did this little display right here you know and notice how the same print that's on the back of that little bench is also on that throw pillow. You know I love to let you listen to the bells. Usually mostly happens during Christmas time, but guess what? It's happening now for spring. Look at this piece so beautiful all these items are super colorful remember last time i was mentioning like looking at this stuff does make me feel like do i need to go you know a little more colorful like a little pop of color or print or something it's very inspiring now here we go with what was in the boxes uh at least you know in my mind these were the things <laughs> six hundred dollars for this uh, swivel couch situation 180 for this plant which i don't think it's worth it because those leaves look i don't know they look they look a little fake you know they look a little fake even though the what are those what is that velvet what are those called fiddle leaf trees their leaves tend to look kind of look at that piece back there that's what i was just like oh we need to go look at that um they tend to look a little bit fake i feel look at this a thousand dollars gigantic a lot of this these big pieces at my at least at my local home goods a lot of the times they tend to have like some type of damage this one didn't and we're gonna see another one that's also really big that also didn't have any damages so that's a plus that's really good I was not happy with that couch. Like, why does it look like it's been in somebody's house already? Look at this one too. I did like how their little feet were like on little wheels, you know? But did they not look like they were already, you know, like thrifted? Why, why do we have thrifted items at Home Goods right now? <laughs> not okay. This is that other piece. This one is even bigger. This is gigantic. It's $800. I kind of like it for myself, you know? I'm not looking to purchase right now, but isn't that always the case? Like when you're not looking to buy something is when you see the things that you would want. 350 for this guy right here. It's on clearance. Look at all those boxes. Do you see that? There's more. But wait, there's more. And we're coming back. So stay tuned. Now, these two, I feel, either have been here a while or they restock them. Do you guys remember these? But look at the price point. What? $1,400 and that's clearance price for one. They look good together too, but you know, put them to match as my mother would say, coordinate. How cute are these? Love that super vibrant color. It's so good. And it's like a theme going on here because there's plenty more where this came from when it comes to like the pink, whether it's the softer pink or that vibrant pink then there's this one kind of similar but a little more toned down i love these i thought these were really cute don't know how to say that it's 200 dollars, but it comes with a little see how it says it's, it's a set it comes with a little poof at the bottom which is nice that you can push it under 
you know look at this i was like wow 150 dollars it looks like original price was 200 so that's 50 dollars savings unlike sometimes when they just do a dollar <laughs> but it's huge it's really big this piece is really pretty tahari 300 dollars isn't that nice very nice. I love it. 200, 150. This is a set right here. Not, I mean, you know, you have to buy them individually, but you can make it into a set. <laughs> Look at this. They have a couple of these. This one is 500. As you can see, it's all glass in the front. It has like a leather texture. It's a very interesting texture. It looks really cool. If that's like your style you know if it goes with what your your vibes if you will what whatever it is you're going for in your decor but definitely cool a little mexico piece for 130. lots of little tables right now like i said this is this is what was in the boxes all the things are out $100 for this one with two little drawers. I don't love the color. I think that would have been so cute in a different color. Oh, these are so good. Nautica, $80. There's storage under there. There's two of them. Because usually I feel like if you're going to buy these poofs, like you're going to get two, you know? So you can coordinate, like balance it out, if you will. Look at these wood ones up here. $80. I say wood, but I don't think they're real wood. It's not like actual solid wood. At least I don't think they are. Look at the back of these. So these are the ones that we were just looking at before. And once I saw the back, I was like, oh, look at the back. I love how it's like solid, you know? I thought that was cool. So depending on where you have them, if the back is what people are seeing, it's okay because it looks really pretty. Lots of tables, more boxes. More for us to come back and see, y'all. Lots of these desk chairs. They're so pretty. Here's that other piece that has like that same leather feel to it. This one, as you can see, does not have the glass doors. 400. You see that? like snake it's well i was gonna say snake print but like snake like a snake oh i don't even want to think about it my son's uh <laughs> artwork is still here the lion the lion i'm calling it his artwork but obviously no one has bought it including myself like i told you guys for valentine's day when hit when that's his birthday he got money I'm sure he appreciated the money way more than the lion, uh, the lion uh, artwork. 130 for this piece. We saw this one right here last week. This one is 150. I love how it looks, but I don't like the fact that it's not framed. You know. And then look at this. This mirror. So good. Is this still a thing? Are we still loving these big mirrors? $400. It doesn't have to be a thing. I like it. I wanted this one. Again, not looking to purchase right now. But, hello, by the way. Hi. <laughs> but, um, if I was, this could have been it. $400 is not bad. It's gigantic. This thing is huge. Huge. 150 for two pieces right here look at that i love the sides of it you know like the those like little ball things that they did on the side i just love the whole thing i've seen so many mirrors like that that i'm like oh it's okay but i don't love it mm, it's okay i really really love this one but yet again not ready to purchase 25 dollars for these baskets or not all of them but you know that one <laughs> <laughs> this one is 20 they didn't have all the baskets out i think some of these boxes you know the cardboard boxes um probably have baskets in them or at least 
fingers crossed i hope they do this one has an actual lid for 25 because this little display i mean you could see baskets right there to the right hand side but it wasn't anything we haven't seen already it wasn't like oh yeah it's basket time kind of vibes it was just like eh, just a few good ones look at these these are so nice black velvet what is that velvet and then hello kitty what this is so cute i feel like hello kitty's having a moment 130 dollars for the hello kitty look at that so pretty it's never been gone i know it's never been you know hello kitty has always been a thing but right now home goods tj maxx probably even marshall's they seem to have a lot of hello kitty items right now $40 for these shams. They're so nice and nice and big and soft. Really, really nice. We got some Easter throw pillows. Set of two for 30. These are also nice and soft. We saw that rabbit last week. Now here's that pack of three. Remember I was mentioning the pack of three? Well, Home Goods has it now for 30. Last time we saw that one was at TJ Maxx. And then this floral one is so pretty. Look at that. Yes. So floral on one side and then like the, is that gingham? Would that be considered gingham maybe? Am I saying that right? It's $25. I love the scalloped like little ruffle on that one. Look at these shams. Love this color combination, the print, all the things. Loved everything about it. 40. I kind of like these shams like this where it already has that design on them instead of having to buy like the sham cases like the pillow cases for the shams right I thought that was cool okay my home goods has moved around where they're keeping the bath stuff and I'm actually not upset I kind of like it I like how they did this like display which by the way if you're looking to decorate with pink your bathroom if you're looking to make your bathroom pink or like pink accents, Home Goods is where it's at right now. They have all things pink, like I said earlier, like pink is a vibe right now. But you see how they kind of like put the collections together, all the colors together. I thought that was nice. I hope they keep it like this because this like makes way more sense and kind of gives you like a visual of how the items look. I don't know. It makes it's just it makes my eyes happy. <laughs> if that makes sense i always tell you guys i like for things to be like nicely displayed or else i like don't even want to i don't even want to be on that block you know i don't even want to be in the aisle i can't i just can't can't do it by the way these they're not glass it's melamine it's a plastic okay but look at how pretty that little tray is 13 dollars. very cute i actually really surprisingly liked this whole little collection right here. And then of course, they put out more Easter. We looked at this whole little area last time. So I was just kind of trying to see what was new. I wasn't sure if we saw these last week. It's $13. The little rabbit is holding bunny, if you will holding a little egg in different cut like different ones have different colors blue pink i think there's like a purplish one back there how cute is this baby that little dress the flower crown only 13 dollars. look at the little ballerina shoes so cute and that you can see they have several different ones love so adorable this display was a little more visible this time. Look at the baskets. The baskets here at Home Goods are where it's at. I, I must say. Usually I'm into the ones that are like, look at that. The smallest one is 10, 13 for the medium, and then 15 for the largest. And that's a pretty nice large one too. Love that. Like a canvas material. We saw these last week. I'm usually into the ones at Michael's. But I will say, Home Goods is coming through, y'all. Home Goods is coming through. Look at what is happening there. What what is what was that? For twenty-five dollars. Remember the little church birdhouse? It's still here. Nobody has purchased it. I love it. It's so pretty. 
this beaded throw pillow here we are again what is happening with these eighty dollars for this topiary situation that matches the bunnies guys seriously yay or nay yay or nay on those <laughs> like it's gonna be a no for me but what is happening why do they have so many do you see them am i right i don't know i'm not into it they're a little gaudy i said it there it is they're a little gaudy $17 for Peter Rabbit himself. Very cute. And the fact that it's a round pillow. Love. More of those baskets in a different print. This big daddy egg. I could not lift it. I couldn't put like my little fingers in there to try. My little fingers. That's why I couldn't put them in because they're not little. <laughs> it was heavy. I couldn't lift it. So I don't know what the price point is there. But there it is. These are a cult classic at this point. They have them every year. $10 there. And then look at this one. It has a little basket back there. You can put a little plant, eggs, anything, whatever you can think of. This one was not heavy. It looks like it would be, but it's not. It's $30. And then look at this little guy with his little polka dot bow tie. $17. Very cute. Don't fall, sir. Do not fall. Here's what's happening in the wreath section and maybe a couple of garlands. We saw pretty much all of these last week. They were in a different area, but still, nonetheless, we saw them. $15 for that one. It's small. A little spring vibe, not necessarily Easter. That one is $50. Look at these trays gigantic $50 they're so cool looking Tommy Bahama made in the Philippines or like the Philippine collection $40 for the smaller one these are both huge though but the bigger one is like outrageously big and then here's some of the goodies $25 for this like lemon bunt situation Lots of really good candy, chocolate for all the baskets, if you will. Right now, it's all about the syrups. This pomegranate one, I purchased it. It's delicious. I don't know this brand, though. The pomegranate brand, the Torani, that one I know, and it's very good. And I love that the bottles are glass. But this other, Mateo's, Joe, I know, but I'd never tried it. But if you've tried this other brand, this Mateo brand, let me know. Grenadine is always good. That is going to be it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Please give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Click the notification bell so you won't miss any of my upcoming videos. And let's keep the party going by clicking on one of these videos right here on the screen. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.